Boy, we're going to show you something that's going to blow your mind um, with Kanye West. But before we do, I just want to say, in a few minutes, we're going to have Marianne Williamson on, who is the most talked about person of all those people on that stage at the Democratic debate last night. Um, and there's a reason she was talked about. And it was a, I think, kind of a transformative evening on many levels. Not, we'll get just, there. not just in the debate, but maybe for the country. But I think. We'll get to that. So we're going to get to that. Speaking of transformations, uh, Kanye West, by the way, has... That was very good. That was very good. Wow, did I just get a compliment well, from him? That was a good. I All mean, right, when you get it in the it. show, I got a compliment. <laughs> uh, Kanye West is out to transform, uh, perhaps, the way you live in the future, uh, the way millions of people could live in the future. He has been secretly working on concepts for uh, for housing. So we and got we got we these, got these photos. We got these photos. And this is out in Calabasas is, on land he purchased, and he he has 300 acres, and we knew over a year ago that he wanted to build a housing development of sorts there. And we, we thought to ourselves, why does Kanye want to build a housing development? Right. It seems like, why does he want to get into the real estate business? Well, that's why. This is not, this is not just building a bunch of condos. He's not building a subdivision out in uh, these, Calabasas. Are, these are prototypes of what he believes can be the way people should live in the future. And, 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 his word is right. It's transformative. He's done his homework on this, too. He has a whole team working on this, and he's worked with a team of architects. Uh, they've studied architect from all around the world from the beginning of time as well. They've been looking at different structures and different ways people lived, and what they'd like to do is kind of bridge the gap between the rich and the poor and find housing that everyone can use. Now, so the idea here is, I suppose, it's kind of ultimately one size fits all, where you take these domes and these become homes. Um, homes, um, I, interestingly, without windows, and that to hmm. me says these are, they're going to be stacked one next to another next to another, but if you notice at the top, there's light that comes through. You right. can see up, and, you know, it's Star wars -y on a level. It does look like something you've seen which, on a Star Wars set. Which we had heard about before, right? About a month or, month or so ago, we had heard that there were going to be, that he was interested in this sort of Star Wars type design. So really actually seeing it verifies, you know, the information that we had already been hearing about. And, and you know, you wonder, well, why is Kanye West getting into this business? I, I will tell you this, that Kanye West is a really, uh, an innovative Architect. He doesn't have a license as an architect, but Kanye West has done this. He's done this on his own personal space at his home where he's built it completely kind of reimagining right. what a home should look like. And, you know, uh, we were talking about this in the morning meeting today that one of the people in this town who's got the most respect of just about anybody is Brad Pitt, that he is at a level architecturally that architects marvel at. And, right. and Brad Pitt has that talent. Kanye has a lot of that talent. But, but the point of, I mean, I, I'm, I'm imagining here that is the overall point here it's is he wants housing. to create affordable housing yeah. Yeah. for, right, this is not about... Well, I mean, you want to do it in the most efficient way, and that's what the architecture comes in. Right. So, like, it, 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 um, I'd heard about some things like this that he was doing a while back. There are a whole bunch of ways that... Uh, I guess Kanye believes that we can bridge a social, a socioeconomic gap, and affordable housing would be one of the most important yeah. things that you could do. Now, the interesting thing about this, I can't tell spatially, like how big what happens inside. Well, so we, haven't, we, we haven't, haven't seen, seen the inside, inside right. but they look kind of big. Wait, pull out real quick again to the picture again. Is the that shot? Kanye and Kim's house right there? Uh, you know what? I so that's a property that they own, no, but it, that not. is not that's, the house that oh, they've Oh, because been. That's everybody's going to be trying to live in the hut. <laughs> yeah. yeah, like, you know, maybe, like, yeah, exactly. the whole, like, the I'll whole take, city. I'll take one, no, yeah. that, that's is actually it, a property that it was an existing structure that they purchased, and this land, you know, there's uh, about 300 acres, I believe. It's a huge parcel out there in Calabasas. Uh, that they're using the land portion to sort of build this prototype, but they've left the existing structure there. What, what I'm trying to figure out is, you know, one of the things that a lot of architects are doing around the world is they're creating smaller spaces for homes, but really using them efficiently. This seems different to me. They don't, this doesn't seem like a 500 square foot home. It seems bigger. Um, yeah. But still, what yeah, he wants to... You can't tell what's inside. But you yeah, can't it tell, does, but you does look you, like it's bigger than 500 square feet. You see what I mean? I mean, it, it, it does... I, it's hard to tell spatially, right. but it looks bigger. But the idea is kind of, you know, just eliminating, the, like Van said, the class structure yeah. and, you know, and creating this... Um, it, 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 I think there's still a class structure, but it allows people 
who are who can't get affordable housing now. We don't know what this costs, and that's the other right. thing. We don't know what this costs, and maybe the idea you is you mass. Know at this well, point. but maybe it, the idea is you mass produce this to where it, everything becomes right. so much cheaper. Yeah. Hi, my name is Oliva Escobar from Romeoville, Illinois, and I'd say three words to describe Kanye's architectural concept is uh, futuristic, weird like himself, and unique. Actually, I think all three of those words apply they work. To, uh, to Kanye. They work.